Hey, what's up, everybody? I go by the name of Kingdom Child, and I am a rapper. Um, I want to share with you um, my first fruit uh, testimony. So I go to a church uh, in Blanta, uh, Malawi, called Mavuna Church, Blanta. And um, by that time, I was just a young Christian uh, who's new to the faith and just a rapper, you know, just gave my life to Christ. And I met this pastor. Um, his name is Pastor Timothy Kaburu. Uh, who by then was serving there and he challenged me to give a first fruit offering to the church and i really wasn't sure about this thing because this was a totally new concept for me but then i was i was just like you know on fire for christ you know a new christian you know so i i decided i was gonna do that but what really sparked up um the challenge was the fact that i had to move from uh, one job to another, one organization to, to the other. And it required me to write a resignation letter uh, from the other organization to go to the next one. And I was trusting God that God's going to provide for me. Uh, but when, when I told that to my pastor and he told me, you should give a fresh, first fruit uh, offering when you get that job. And I was like, okay, fine. Since you're my disciple and you have given me an instruction, though I don't understand it fully, um, and though I don't understand how God's gonna provide when I've given all my money, but I'm just gonna trust uh, your word and trust God that he's gonna do it. So I did that. And then he uh, immediately asked me, what are you praying for? So I, I told him, when I get the job, you know, you usually have to go for a probation and it's usually six months probation. So I told him, I don't want to stay in the probation period for long. Um, so two weeks later, I got a phone call and someone saw my designs. I'm a graphic designer as well. Someone saw my designs and they were ready to employ me right away. And they told me to go to the office. I went to the office and they gave me a job right away. And they told me, I'm gonna give you six months probation. And I was like, wow, okay. So I went back to my past and I told them, uh, they're giving me six months probation, but remember I said I want three months. And I worked for, th uh, for three months. The, th the third month, uh, someone called me again. <laughs> After I gave my first food and everything, things were fine. You know, I, I didn't really struggle. But then the third month, they called me and they asked me, uh, another company actually called me and asked me, uh, are you working anywhere else? And I was like, yeah, I actually found a job. Uh, so they were like, okay. We need you to come to our company. We need to talk. And I was like, well, what's the worst that could happen? Let me just go. And I went there and the guy gave me an offer letter and he was like, we want to give you a job. And I'm like, but I'm already working somewhere. I'm like, well, it's business. Just look at the offer and see. <laughs> and then you tell us what you think. And I looked at the offer and I'm just like, wait a minute, hold up. This is even more than my first fruit. And that they're, uh, they're talking about uh, like this is the probation payment that they're going to give me. And I realized, I remembered the prayer that I prayed. And the action that I took from there was, I just took the offer letter and went with it to the other organization, straight to my boss's office. And I'm like, boss, I'm in a dilemma. <laughs> uh, it, it might not be good for you, but it's good for me. <laughs> so I placed my letter on his desk and I was like, these guys are offering me something more than you are so i don't know what you're you're gonna do but you have to make a counter offer and the boss looked at it and he actually made a counter offer which was more than what i even expected and upon that he said we're gonna confirm you you're no longer on probation you you have the you have the full-time job and the full-time benefits and i was like wow and that was it. I went back rejoicing. And from then on, my life has never been the same. I was like, I'm going to start tithing. <laughs> I'm going to start giving first fruit. It hasn't been like consistent, but I believe that with my experience, there's nothing that can change my mind about that. Yeah. So there's outcome and first fruit. Yeah.